Michael, Cameron Walker has set the scene very nicely for us, hearing that uh, Prince William has had to uh, pull out of this event, well, very much at the last mm. minute. What's your assessment? Yeah, he always does, Cameron, sets the scene. Um, I hope it's not serious, but I think it is worrying. Let's put it like that. Uh, it has been made clear from an unnamed source that uh, the reason for him pulling out of this memorial service for his godfather and second cousin, uh, King Constantine II of Greece, has nothing to do with uh, Kate. And there we see her looking lovelier in, in, in happier times. Uh, let's hope it's nothing to do with that. We do not know. I think it is unusual, as you've said, at the last minute uh, to pull out. That said, uh, the royal family was well represented there. Queen Camilla was there. And, uh, of course, other members of the royal family, including uh, the Duke of York and uh, Sarah Ferguson, one of the rare events, rare royal events, where their presence is not only accepted, but probably welcome, because this is very much a family affair. King Constantine of Greece was very close to the royal family and all members of his royal f of his own family were very close and very friendly. There we see the, the Duke, was this when he was on the air ambulance? Yeah, there he is with his wingman, uh, Tom Cruise, and he got off a couple of good jokes there. He's been flying solo, of course, since the 17th of January, or that, that shocking day of double uh, the royal announcements of, first of all, uh, the Princess of Wales and then the King going into the London Clinic or for treatment. Mm -hmm. And of course, he's making uh, a brave face of it all. He's affable with everybody. He was a very good up here in East Anglia, a very excellent uh, pilot of the air ambulance up here. And he saw a lot of terrible things, road accidents yeah. and so on. He did the job. And of course, he was at BAFTA, smiling and schmoozing with the stars on Sunday. Mm -hmm. But he did yeah. look slightly, did you not think, Emily and Tom, a little bit alone, a little bit lost without... Uh, his wingman, his real wingman in life, uh, Kate. So we don't know what is going on. As I said at the beginning uh, to you both, I hope it's nothing serious, but it is unusual, not unprecedented, but it's unusual at the very last minute. However, being the gentleman that he is, uh, Prince William did make it clear to King Constantine's uh, widow and his heir, uh, Prince Pavlos, um, that he wouldn't be there and I'm quite sure that nobody took it untoward. They understood that he had a personal matter yes. and he had to deal with it. Well, Michael Cole, let's hope that we see him again soon. You're right to remind us we did see him as recently as Sunday. But Michael Cole, former BBC Royal Correspondent, thank you for your time.